And blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness, we have this bread to offer, which earth has given and human hands have made. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God. By the mystery of this water and wine, may we come to share in the divinity of Christ, who humbled himself to share in our humanity. And blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness, we have this wine to offer. Fruit of the vine and the work of human hands, it will become our spiritual drink. And Lord God, we ask you to receive us and be pleased with the sacrifice that we offer you with humble and contrite hearts. Lord, wash away our iniquity, cleanse us from our sin. Pray, friends, that this, our sacrifice, may become acceptable to God, the Father Almighty. And Lord, our God, may the bread and wine you give us for our nourishment on earth become the sacrament of our eternal life. And we ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. And the Lord be with you. Lift up your hearts, and let us give thanks to the Lord our God. All-powerful and ever-living God, we do well always and everywhere to give you thanks. Through your beloved Son, you created our human family, and through him you restored us to your likeness. And therefore it is your, light, your right to receive the obedience of all creation, the praise of the church on earth, and the thanksgiving of your saints in heaven. We too rejoice with the angels as we proclaim your glory forever. You are holy indeed, the fountain of all holiness. Let your spirit come upon these gifts to make them holy, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. Before he was given up to death, a death he freely accepted, he took bread and gave you thanks. He broke the bread, gave it to his disciples, and said, Take this, all of you, and eat it. This is my body, which will be given up for you. And when supper was ended, he took the cup. Again, he gave you thanks and praise. He gave the cup to his disciples and said, take this, all of you, and drink from it. This is the cup of my blood, the blood of the new and everlasting covenant. It will be shed for you and for all so that sins may be forgiven. Do this in memory of me. Let us proclaim the mystery of faith. Christ has died, Christ is risen, Christ will come again. In memory of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Father, this life-giving bread and this saving cup, and we thank you for counting us worthy to stand in your presence and serve you. May all of us who share in the body and blood of Christ be brought together in unity by the Holy Spirit. And Lord, remember your church throughout the world. Make us grow in love together with Benedict, our Pope, Thomas, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember our brothers and sisters who have gone to their rest in the hope 
of rising again. Bring them and all the departed into the light of your presence. Have mercy on us all and make us worthy to share eternal life with Mary, the Virgin Mother of God, with the apostles and with all the saints who have done your will throughout the ages. And may we praise you in union with them and give you glory through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, with him, in him, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours, almighty Father, forever and ever. And faithful to the teaching of Jesus, we pray as he taught. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. And deliver us, Lord, from every evil, and grant us peace in our day. In your mercy, keep us free from sin and protect us from all anxiety as we wait in joyful hope for the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. And Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, my peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and grant us the peace and the unity of your kingdom where you live forever and ever. Amen. And may the peace of the Lord be with you always. And, also with you. and let us offer to each other then a sign of that peace. <laughs> 